Hello and welcome to this series of tutorials on text analysis using Python. Now, I've tried to avoid the term natural language processing because it's a very broad field of study. And as a linguist, I am particularly interested in analyzing texts. Now, what is text analysis? And especially, we are talking about computerized text analysis. So, text analysis is the process of transforming unstructured textual data into meaningful insights. Now, let's see what this definition means. So, unstructured textual data. How on earth can texts be unstructured? Because we know texts have a structure. That's why we understand them. In linguistics, the word syntax means arrangement or a structure. So every text should have a structure so that you as a human being would be able to figure out the meaning of that text. But when we talk about unstructured textual data, we're talking from the perspective of computers. So a text to a computer is unstructured data because it does not follow any predefined models or organizations or labels that computer understands as structured. And about the term meaningful insights, what kind of insights are we talking about? Now, here, what insights? Well, one of them is textual patterns. So when a linguist or a social scientist analyzes a text or the content, they look for certain patterns. And from a linguistic perspective, perspective, those patterns could be the use of certain phrases or expressions or words. So they might look for a frequency of some specific vocabulary. That is one of these types of textual patterns. Or you might look for literary devices, for example, parallelisms, metaphors, sarcasm. These are all textual patterns. Another area is sentiment analysis. You might want to review, you want, not review, actually analyze the reviews from a website like Amazon and decide if reviews are negative or positive. You might want to analyze tweets about certain presidential candidate and decide if the overall sentiment is positive or the attitude of the large number of people is positive towards a candidate or negative or certain trends, certain releases. Then you have topic modeling. With topic modeling, you, you're looking for specific themes and topics within texts. Which words or topics carry the most weight in a text? And text classification is basically, well, what it is, classifying texts. So if you go to a news agency website, a website for, uh, for news, you would see there are different categories, sports, tech, business, economy, foreign policy, politics, these categories. So we can, using machine learning, classify texts based on the data we already have. So you can give a piece of text to the machine and it will predict what category it fits. That this belongs to, for example, the politics category. This one belongs to sports category. So we are going to use Python to do all these. Why Python? Well, Python is popular and readable, very easy to learn and use. And additionally, it's got a lot of powerful libraries such as NLTK and Spacey these two are amazing NLP libraries. But before I end this video, so this was just an introduction to the series which is to come. Now, in that series, in the first episode, I'm going to talk about very simple basic stuff, working with text files, working with CSV files, using Python. In later episodes, I will introduce you to Spacey, uh, NLTK, TextBlob, Vader, Birtopic, and a lot more. Well, I hope you've liked this introductory video, and see you in the next videos. Thank you for watching and listening.